Hey Quan, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys all of my paper school shoes that are in one drawer. And you've might seen this before, and I'm just gonna be showing you guys all of my school shoes. Before we get started, I am wearing two coats, so I'm pretty hot, but yeah. We will be doing a giveaway soon. Yes, but stay tuned for my next video to see what the giveaway is. So, without further ado, let's just get on with the video. So, the first one I have is this cat. And if you are, you guys are wondering, you can count. I don't, I, yeah. I have this cat squishy, which is pretty squishy. So, if you guys hear any background noises. Next one is this book. And it actually has someone else's name on it, so... And this one is the one I gave packaging to. Um, this one's one of my favorites. Um, so I'm gonna show it last. This um, Team Mario Penguin inspired penguin. Squishy. It's pretty squishy. Next one, and it comes in a series, so let me just find the whole series first. Okay, so there's three in the series. There's a chip bag, really squishy um both of these have packaging this ice cream bag thingy you know how they come in like those bags that's what this is and the packaging is so crinkled um but yeah next one is this one and this one is actually my favorite so i'll squish it last this one's another one of my favorites another one of my favorites and another one of my favorites so there's a lot of squishies that I'm going to be showing you at the end because they're like my favorite squishies. So, yeah. Um, I have this, um, it says gumball machine. And the packaging, all my packaging are really crinkly. Or like, yeah. So, I actually don't like this in its packaging, so I'll pick it out of the packaging for you guys. Here it is outside of the packaging just as squishy and I'll put it in and I'll squish it in the packaging for because I know some people really like the noises that like the packaging makes I do have to like agree on that because sometimes I do really like the noises that like the packaging thing makes if you know what I'm saying but yeah I'm just putting it back in um it's the wrong way around but yeah, I'm going to close this silly thing. Here it is. So, yeah. Next thing is this blanket squishy to go along with all the pillows that I have. I know it kind of looks like a pillow, but yeah. It's not a pillow. It's a blanket. Next one is this um, bone squishy. And this is super cute and really squishy. You can't really see it inside of the packaging, but it's actually pretty thorough. I'll check it out of the packaging for you guys. Here it is. It's pretty surprising. Um, but yeah, I have another one that's really surprising that I'm gonna be showing you guys at the end. So stay tuned for the end to see all my favorite paper squishies. So yeah. Next one is this pillow that I made. And I actually had a challenge with my grandma. She's the one my grandma made. And comment down below which one you like better, mine or my grandma's. Well, mine or my grandma's. So here's my grandma's again. Pretty squishy, actually. Or mine. Mine's really squishy. But yeah. Next one is this Christmas Hell Kitty Donut inspired donut. Some of them I'm not going to take out of the packaging like this one, um, but it's this I Bloom Peach inspired squishy. I really like the shading of it. I have this Kawaii chocolate bar, or I call it Kawaii Choco Bar, but whatever. And the packaging is again super crinkled. And this is one of my rare squishies that I had for like a long time. So I'm trying to not crinkle the packaging too much, but yeah. I have this Jumbo Panda bun. 
Um, I have Toasty and Jelly. Here's Jelly. And here's Toasty. I have this Yummy Bear Donut. And it doesn't really have a real hole because it's small. And I was lazy, so I just colored it black. I have this pillow thing. I have this other pillow. I have two pillows that I have that are part of my Rainbow Square series, but the last two or one, I believe, yeah. The last one is um, in my favorites pile, so I'll show it at the end. But here's the first one. I really like it because, like, if it's going to focus, I actually use, like, water to kind of blend it in. And here's another one. This one. I have to say, isn't the most squishy, and it isn't rainbow, it's kind of like stereotyped, if you know what I'm saying. I have this one, pillow, this pillow, it's really squishy. This, this like strawberry that I actually like cut open and fixed. And finally moving on to my favorite squishies. Um, I have this like hay box, and the only reason I like it um, is because it's really colorful and stuff. I have this um, homemade carrot squishy, and the reason I like this one is because it's super soft and pretty squishy. Well, I mean like it's soft, but it's not surprising. I have this Galaxy Pet Pet Zoo Sheep, and I really like it even though it's like pretty dense. I just really like the pattern. And I worked really hard on this. And again, I used water to kind of like imitate like the galaxy a little bit more. I have this koala squishy and I think this is so cute. It's kind of hard to squish it inside of the packaging though. So I'll take it out of the packaging for the people that want me to. And I'm actually not going to keep the squishy inside of the packaging forever. I'm actually going to take it out of the packaging. Not forever, but like, yeah. And there's a piece of tape on it to keep it like in the middle. Here's the packaging. I was going to, here's the piece of tape. So I'll just put it inside. Here's the packaging. It's super cute. But here is the squishy. It's actually pretty soft for a paper squishy and I think it's so cute and it has a little koala there right there like the baby ones so yeah I really love this one I have this rainbow pillow which is part of my rainbow square series and this one is so squishy like for a paper squishy it's really squishy if you want me to um do a tutorial on like good paper squishies like this comment down below um but this is really squishy I have this waffle squishy inspired by miscellaneous fuzzes one. And as you can see, one fourth of it is um, burnt. Like that bar is burnt, but yeah. I have this um, fat paw paw inspired avocado and this is pretty jumbo. And this is so cute. And as you can see, the arms are like taped on because I had to use like water and stuff, so yeah. Next. I have this magic drink and the packaging is really crisp on this one so I don't want to crinkle it too much. So, yeah. And finally, this one. Um, this one I really love, but I feel so bad because the packaging is really crinkled and stuff. I kind of don't want to crinkle it too much, so I'll take it out of its packaging. Here it is pretty squishy. I'll put it inside the packaging and squish it for the people, again, who like to hear like the noises, like the crinkly noises. And it has uh, uh, like cocoa pebbles on the bottom. Comment down below if you guys like cocoa pebbles. But yeah, this is so cute. As you can see, um, like it has a little sad face. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, Kawaii and friends, and.
goodbye. That was so weird, but goodbye.